Hi everyone, so I was working on a small side project to learn OpenAI stuff and uh, midway through, as you know, Next14 got released recently, so I thought why not upgrade my project to Next14, but what I found was that my page compile times were really slow, uh, upwards of like 11 seconds, 12 seconds. So as an example, if I do npm run dev and then just go on the website, locally from the app locally i was getting really slow compile time so now as you can see uh this took only 3.3 seconds but i remember uh, previously before the page compile times were really slow so for example if i were to go to an another page using the link right uh so if i go to jot you can see that even now it's not that fast maybe that's to do with version uh but as you can see, it's it, it took me three seconds to load the generate page. But before, it was taking me 11 seconds, 12 seconds. And the fix that I found for that was that just to upgrade my node version. So if I do node v here, I'm currently using 20.9. This was an upgrade and I had to upgrade this. But before, I believe, I was using, um, if I do NVM list. Yeah, before I was using 18.17 and that is when my page compile times were really, really slow. Even now they're not too fast, three, four seconds, but that's fine. That was normal before. But when I upgraded to next 14 and my node version was 18.17, my compile times were really slow. So all I did was just uh, and node version manager. I imagine most uh, if you're using NPM and web development, you probably have NVM just to manage your node versions. And you just do NPM install dash dash LTS. This, this is going to install the latest stable version. And uh, then you can just use NPM, NVM use dash dash LTS. And now you have the latest node version. I can understand that if you are in very big projects that have been going on for a long time, uh, and you try to upgrade your node version, that might cause some problems with the uh, with the packages and stuff. But if you do want to upgrade to Next14, then I imagine that you are not, you, you do want the latest stuff. So just try to use the latest node version. That might help you solve your uh, long compile times. At least that's what helped me. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to share that. I hope that helps. I hope you find this helpful. And yeah, thank you.